Lighting a five-game losing streak, the Trash Pandas were hoping to turn things around at home, where they had won five of six games during their opening homestand. Things started about as well as they could have hoped for. A leadoff homer for Orlando Martinez puts Rocket City in front in the first. From there, both pitchers would really settle in. Birmingham's Cade McClure allowing one run on four hits while striking out nine. On the other side, Kyle Tyler went six, allowing just two hits and racking up nine Ks for the Trash Pandas. While no other runs were scored, Rocket City had runners in position. The Bondell Isabel turned a grounder into a second when McClure's toss to first went wide. Six foot four and 225 pounds, but no problem on the hustle, but he'd be left stranded. A little later, Ray Patrick Ditter would crush a double to center, bringing up Orlando Martinez. A hit gets past the defender, but not far enough to send Ditter around. Unfortunately, they'd find out too late and he'd get tagged out in a pickle. It wouldn't matter as the Trash Pandas had already scored the only run they'd need, shutting out the league's highest scoring team in the 1-0 victory. While not the prettiest game in franchise history, manager Jay Bell said it was tons of fun and praised the efforts of the guys who made the win possible. Um, you know, really, whenever it came down to it, you had uh, three guys on the offense that did something and three guys on the pitching, on the, on the mound that did something. So it was... It was a tale of six guys tonight that, uh, that got the job done. The Trash Pandas and Barons will be back at it tomorrow at 635.